Hi guys, Ali here. Today is orientation day on Tego University. If you just came across my channel, I'm a JKS scholar, JKSG scholar, and I'm a little nervous <laughs> today. I don't know why. I'm going down already to meet the other scholars. They're gonna come like pick us up. We're gonna meet downstairs and I'm gonna try my best to show you guys what's gonna happen today. If I can't show you guys, I'm gonna talk about it later. So yeah, Ooh. excited, nervous. Let's go. It's gonna start. Basically, this is what it happened. Uh, we had like a language, a language class orientation as well, um, and then they set us to do the writing test. It was like a topic test. I know what a topic. Oh my god, wait a minute. That was very hard. It was very hard. So many of the words that I've never seen before. I'm so frustrated with myself. I'm for sure gonna be like on level one or something because it was really hard. Then we. I don't know, I'm just frustrated. Now we are gonna have some lunch and we need to meet here again at two to do the oral test. And yeah, I just feel dismotivated. I like uh, everything I studied Korean, every Korean thing that I've studied didn't matter at all because the vocabulary was so hard. Uh, I don't know. I know it's to like to level our Korean, but I thought I would like be in like level two at least, but apparently not. And I think the oral, the, like I was a little more confident in the writing test like the test itself because the oral test is gonna be a disaster for me because I don't speak Korean at all I listen very well to Korean nature I listen to Korea very well I don't know I'm just frustrated but I think that's normal I don't I don't know what I was expecting yet. but the girls that know more Korean said the questions were like easier easier and getting harder by the second but I thought everything was hard <laughs> uh, but yeah we're gonna get some lunch I think we're gonna eat in the school cafeteria that I haven't been in yet. I'm gonna show you a little bit of the campus right now. So you don't need to listen to me to like sad Ellie. <laughs> we actually decided to go off campus because we were closer. And this is actually the main gate of Daegu University. Here she is. The logo. We didn't really walk this way before because our dorms are close to the west gate, that's the other gate. So I'm excited to see what we have here because I have no idea. So much they come back. We came to a bibimbap place and it's so cute. I love how they put the rice in the side. And their soup, gochujang, kimchi. That looks so good. Now we're going back to the same center we were because now it's gonna be the oral test I've been practicing like all the Korean I know inside my head <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I'm level one anyway now that I had some time to think about it 
I'm fine with that. It's gonna be a, like a good base. And I think since there are gonna be lots of things that I already know, I'll have more confidence to like speak up and ask questions and read texts and, and stuff like that. So I think that's a positive note. But I'm still nervous about the oral test. I don't like like feeling stupid. <laughs> like, we were talking about Laura and I was, were talking about it because everyone that got the scholarship is smart. Um, so we're like we're really hard on ourselves. I'm not saying I'm smart. Oh my god, that that, <laughs> that feels like I'm saying I'm smart. And it was this first test like in my life that I didn't answer all the questions. Like because I've always liked studying. That's why I'm a little frustrated in myself. But there's nothing I could do because like the level of Korean that the test was was very advanced. So um, if you're a JKS student, the tip I have for you come with your Korean kind of I don't know study as much as you can because even though I studied as much as I could it was still hard for me but they gave an option to the students they said if you don't know any Korean and you wish not to take the test tell us so a lot of students went up and wrote their names I just came back to my room now cuz I don't know, I've been I've been kind of anxious during the day and when I get anxious and like chill for a bit, I get so tired. The oral test, because here's the thing about my level of Korean right now. I can understand a lot of Korean, like a crazy amount of Korean, but I can't speak and my sentences are all over the place, so I need to learn like vocabulary and how to actually... Like I know how to form sentences, like basic sentences, but I'm not very good at it. She kind of tests you from the get-go. She like finds your name in the list and she asks you what's your nationality and then I say I'm from Brazil. She asked me how long have I been studying Korean and I have problems with numbers. I don't know how to actually like I know like Hana do said and the the two number systems but I don't know when to use one and the other. Then I told her I can understand everything you're saying. But it's difficult to me to like form sentences and say it back to you. But yeah, tomorrow we have another full day. I'm gonna try recording a vlog tomorrow as well. Sorry I'm <laughs> covering my face. But yeah, I'm just gonna chill for a bit, like rest for the first day I've been in Deco University because I wasn't able to rest until now. I need to unpack my the rest of my stuff as well, but I'm gonna just chill for a while and get some rest because the test took a lot for me. <laughs> Like emotionally and like my head. We went to the restaurant and I didn't want to read like try to understand all the dishes they had So I just like got a simple bibimbap because I was like I, I can't read Korean anymore today But yeah, the teacher was cute though. She was fun. I hope you guys are having an amazing day as well I'm um, sorry about the very close camera, um, but yeah <laughs> See you guys next time. Kisses from Ellie Bye.